We've got Beach Body Christy, Rebody, Redress, and More Fun coming up after this. All right, Christy's face is one of my favorites. I guess, I guess I can say that. This is one of my favorite budget dolls. We have gotten the face on some fashionistas as well, some career dolls, I believe. It is a very great face. When they put it on this pale skin, it was such a weird thing to do, but this doll turned out to be one of my favorites. She was a budget doll, $5 doll. I do like to get these $5 dolls because I'm going to rebody them anyway and I don't have to worry about anything. $6 actually now in Canada. I have a feeling they're going to drop that back down again. They tend to do that. Every once in a while, Canada will get things at Walmart that are exactly the same price as the States and the Canadian dollar has not been strong for many years. So ugh, our prices are horrible, but it is sometimes we get great Mattel toys at cheaper prices at Walmart here in Canada. Really happy, really excited to get her. I already did a video on rebodying these ones. I redressed them. Their hair, I put them in a box and their hair is really puffing up though. I, I was looking at the fashionistas in Walmart and we are getting the new wave finally. Canada is so behind in so many things, so I don't have a lot of comparisons, but I will show you a lot of stuff. This video is going to be pack jammed. The main event is getting her on a body. I did pick up just this one. We got a few of the newer ones, and I decided I can't keep going, but this girl's head and her body and her headpiece, and I do have a problem dealing with the hair. This hair... African-American hair, best hair. Don't have to do anything with it. it, stays in place, it's gorgeous, you can pick it. Uh, yeah, both of the dolls that I picked up were darker complected girls, love them. They're, they were the standouts from the whole collection, even though prosthetic lag girls, really cool. Hearing aid girl, very, very cool too. I do wanna get them. And that's why I'm not opening this one today, because am I going to hold off? Am I going to get the other ones? It's, it's a good wave this time. Very inclusive. And I love that. Anyway, we're just going to open her. Cheap doll. I don't know how much they are in the States. Let me know down below. Are they $4.97 or whatever Walmart prices are? Very easy to open. You just take her out of the box. Will I get the Millie? The Millie that came with these is a little different. I mean, Millie's always a little different. There's usually more than four four girls, though. Four girls, two boys. I have not seen the boy yet anywhere. I don't think anybody in the States have gotten the boys yet. The Millie, I believe I saw at a overpriced uh, toy store here. But am I, do I need another Millie? She has a center part. The last Millie, let me show you these. These are cool. So, I love collecting the budgets and putting them on bodies. And this is the last Nikki. And this is the new Nikki, but would you call her Nikki because she has the Christie face? Would you call her Nikki even though it's not the Nikki face? But it is the dark complected girl of the group from the beach. So I put these on WWE bodies. These are wrestling dolls that came out a few years ago, now discontinued. But I have bought a lot of uh, the bodies and I often put the fashionista heads on these bodies. I go back and forth from liking the made to move and not liking the made to move but these wwe healthy sturdier hunkier chunkier action dolls are my body of choice so yeah here's the millie from the last time she doesn't have a center part not that it matters to me because look this is how i solved my hair problem all of these low ponies i put them all in this was the collection of the beach girls. They'll always have a boy and a uh, two boys in the beach series. And it's been a very, very long time since we had a wave. This one, I believe, is from 2018. Uh, maybe, maybe it's 2020. Maybe it wasn't as long ago as I think, which actually would be 2019. 
Well, if they say 2020 on them, then they're 2020. I don't know. It has been a few years. Usually they would put these beach girls out with these different crazy tops on them. And they're always fun and crazy. And I don't know. They're, they're a bit too uh, colorful for my taste. But anyway, some of the best heads have come from this line. And the hair is a very natural length, which is kind of okay and something that I can handle. Well, yeah, I can put it in a ponytail. But sometimes, yeah, see, just out of the box, the hair is a fine, very natural length. The hair is never crazy colors like they are with the fashionistas. So the Christy face, it looks great. So such a cute face. I'm really hoping we get a Steffi face. There, There is a Steffi face for the Rewind doll, but I would love to get a budget Steffi. Let's hope that somebody makes a budget Steffi so I can, you know, not feel bad about ripping off the head and customizing it to my perfect liking, like these dolls I did here with their color reveal skirts and their creative world tops and just a simple basic style unlike this bikini even though I do appreciate it I uh, am going to dress her let's rip off her head it's really hot here so I don't have to warm the heads up everything is it's 40 degrees I don't know that's like a hundred in your language in the States so everything's nice and warm and I don't have to worry about it. I don't have an exact match for the head. So this body that I use, which is the Naomi body, is going to have to be the one that I use, even though it's not perfect. Even It looks okay. It looks great on camera, actually, in my opinion, to the arm. But let's see here. Is it this? Is it this body? I don't have all of the made to moves like this. This one's a little too dark. And then, see, my Naomi body is the same as this. And it does work. It's not perfect, but that's the, that's the one I'm going with. And I don't have anything in between. So out of all of the BMRs and the looks, this that's the color tone that I think works the best for me. And I have to get her on a body with joints so that I can pose her. Yeah, that's not looking so good on the camera, but we're doing it anyway. Once we put some clothes on her, I guess it's going to be okay. And uh, we did experiment with uh, the skirts from the color reveal sparkle and shine or sprinkles sunshine and sprinkles series and these are the other two examples will i get the millie that's what i don't know let's put her in a skirt i have my favorite fashions here's another video that's coming up this used to be my favorite my very favorite pieces of clothing and there wasn't very much in here and I guess as I try things on and put things in here and then experiment with um, looks dolls and there's curviers. So I really have to reorganize all of my clothes. But this was the stuff that I pulled as my favorite pieces. And now it's my favorite pieces plus. I, yeah, I, I, uh, it's really hard to keep a minimal wardrobe, but we're going to find something for her to wear in here, even though it's going to be really hard for me to dig through here. I think we're going to start with the skirts. I noticed that using the designer's uh, inspiration and as a starting off point, she looked great in orange. She looked great in blue. So from the Sprinkles, Sunshine and Sprinkle series, so much going on in one video just to open up a beach doll since she had this purpley pink outfit gee i could i could go either way what are we going to do i guess it depends on the top that i can find let's see if i can find maybe a creatable world top in here i want a simple basic because i want to show you how i would personally my personal style is simple and basic. But 
stylish. You want one piece that stands out. I guess that would be that colorful skirt. But I don't know how easy this is going to be for me to find something in here without dumping it out. And I've got no place to do it here. I'm going to do it right here. I have too much stuff prepared for this video. Maybe somebody's wearing all of my simple t-shirts. It's a gray one. That might have to be the best I can do. Look at some of my favorites. I don't know if these things are necessarily all my favorite pieces anymore because like I said, I started just throwing stuff in here as I was using it. Yeah, I don't have any simple t-shirts left. And oh, there's a whole other box of great things. Maybe I'll use this one. I'm gonna use this one. It's cool, it's graphic. It does remind me of those two Chinese sets that I opened that are so nice. Definitely check out those three videos I did on those two Chinese sets. And I'm going to uh, look at it again. I do have a little box like this where I separated those outfits. Don't always like a graphic tee, but in this case, check it out. Cute. It's a cute little top. It does remind me of the pieces that were in that set. And then we could go with pink, but let's uh, play homage to her original outfit. And uh, that, that does look really good. But we will go with the purple and blue and bring in some other colors in here just like her outfit so it's the same look as her bathing suit except she's got now she's got this beach body not those thin appendages that barbie is so known for whoa this skirt is tight i like these they're a little bit more curvy most of barbie clothes fit on these and they look better the clothes look better because they just fill out the clothing a little bit more Gotta get that shift at the elastic down. Oh, there we go. They do have a little underwear ledge that you can balance them. I guess that's the same for Barbie too. What do you do? Do you pull your piece down and try to balance it on the underwear hip? Or do you let it go up? I think I usually like to like it fall up. And then that is one cute little simple basic outfit and I don't have my shoes here today. I'm going to have to do another shoe video. Do I have the dolls with the shoes? No. No I don't. I have a big mess here. I'm liking her. Do I want to put her in a color block black and white skirt? Did you see that video where I pulled out all of my favorite... Oh look, there's a shoe. There's some boots. Can I give her these black boots? I was going to put her in this We've, I fumbled around enough here. I think we're very happy with this outfit. This is the only other WWE shoes I have standing by right now. So let's just put her in these boots. She can add a little edge to her outfit. She's looking cute. I love it. I love her. I love her face. Let me know what you're looking forward to. Are you looking forward to any of these video ideas that I, that I mentioned? Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Is this video too crazy for you? Did you stay till the end? See you next time. Yeah. I love her. It does look, it does look better without the bright lights on her. Yeah, like you can see there that no, maybe you can't see. The head looks good on here. I like this outfit. It was a, a pleasant surprise. This top I should wear more. I guess maybe I'm... I guess the 90s craze that's happening right now with all the color blocking is uh, getting to me. Oh, got one of those loose hairs on here. You got to trim these hairs sometime. So soft. The swim line, the play line, the little cheap discount dolls, so inexpensive and great quality hair. Great head, definitely recommended.